Before I proceed to the questions, let me list out the formulae. For direct mapping, couple of formulae will remain same as what we have learned in main memory and cache. So let me write down them. When we know the main memory size, cache size and block size, we can have these formulae. Memory size is 2 power physical address, cache size is 2 power cache address and block size is 2 power block offset. For main memory, we can find number of blocks which is memory size by block size which is equal to 2 power block index. Similarly, from the cache, we can find number of lines which is cache size by block size and this is 2 power cache index. These are the common formulae and for exclusive for the direct mapping, when we know the physical address, first few bits are block offset, the next few bits are cache index or the line number and the rest of the bits are tag bits. Here is the labeling. These are important. Make a note of this in your book. Consider a direct map cache of size 32 KB with block size 32 bytes. The CPU generates 32 bit addresses. The number of bits needed for cache indexing and the number of tag bits respectively are. This is a question asked in gate 2005 for 2 marks. Here we need to find the cache indexing. So basically this is the CI bits and the number of bits for tag. So we need to find the tag bits. For this, let's write the given data. Cache size is 32 KB. 32 is 2 power 5, K is 2 power 10. Therefore, this we can write as 2 power 15 bytes. So we need 15 bits for cache addressing. So CA is 15 bits. Then we have block size. It's given as 32 bytes. So we can write this as 2 power 5 bytes. So 5 bits are needed for block offset. And physical address is 32 bits. Now, if we represent this in a diagram, physical address it's 32 bits and we already know that cache address is 15 bits so least significant 15 bits will be the cache address in that 15 bits first few bits are your block offset and we got it it is actually 5 so let's write this as 5 and the remaining bits in the cache address are the cache index bits so i can write cache index is cache address minus block offset which is 15 minus 5 that becomes 10 bits then the leftover bits in the physical address they are the tag bits and tag bits let me find it from physical address and cache address so tag bits equals physical address bits minus cache address bits this is 32 minus 15 is equal to 17 bits so the answer is 10 and 17 so option a here we have another question. Consider a machine with a byte addressable main memory of 2 power 20 bytes and the block size is 16 bytes and a direct mapped cache having 2 power 12 cache lines. Let the addresses of the two consecutive bytes in the main memory is this and this. What are the tag and cache line address for main memory of address E201F which is in hexadecimal. Alright, let's solve this. Memory size, it is given as 2 power 20 bytes. Therefore, we need 20 bits for physical address. So, PA is 20 bits. Then block size is given. It is 16 bytes. So, that is basically, this is 2 power 4 bytes. So, we need 4 bits for block offset. Then number of lines are given. Number of lines in the cache, it is... 2 power 12 lines. So for cache indexing, we need 12 bits. So CI is 12 bits. Now let's try to represent this in a diagram. Physical address is 20 bits. Then first few bits are block offset and we found it as 4 bits. Then the next few bits are cache index and that is 12. Then the leftover bits are tag bits and the tag bits will be so from 20 we'll subtract. 12 and 4 so 20 minus 12 is 8 and 8 minus 4 is 4 so we need 4 bits for tag now in the question they have given a specific memory address and in and for that particular address they are asking for the tag bits and cache index bits 
so let me write this in uh, binary format address is actually e two zero one f e is triple one zero two is zero zero one zero zero is all zeros then one is three zero one f is all ones so basically this is the address and if you carefully observe each one is four bits four 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 and they're five so four into five 20 bits so they match now looking at this diagram i can categorize this four bits are block offset so this is your block offset then they're saying 12 bits so four eight and 12 so till here this is your cache index and the rest of the four bits are tag bits so this is the tag bits now from this diagram we can make out so tag bits means it is e and cache index means 201 therefore the answer is a e and 201